So instead of thousands of people watching in Las Vegas and hundreds of thousands of people outside in these cities, hanging out, camping out, being part of this live event, this is the digital NFL draft. Roger Goodell, the commissioner, he will be announcing these picks from his basement in Westchester County. He and his dog, actually, they participated in a social media promotion to encourage fans to boo him on social media, just like they would boo him actually for real in the stands. So that's the commissioner making those picks from his basement. But the team general managers and the coaches and the executives, all of them are setting up their war rooms in dining rooms like this that I'm in, in their basements, all those sort of work from home situations. And most of these executives, they're relying on special helpers, mainly their spouses and their kids to answer phones from their team and other teams looking for trades and to cross off players off the board when they've been drafted by other teams. Now, as for the prospects themselves, they will all be at home. Many of the top prospects, dozens of them, they've been sent cameras so we can watch their live reactions with their friends and family. But they have been told by the league, you better keep up that social distancing. We better not see a bunch of people at home with you hanging out and celebrating. All these players have also been given a hat for every NFL team because they don't know which team is going to draft them. But the actual picks are actually being made on a Microsoft Teams conference call. It's a work conference call, just like any other that you and I would do. So all the team GMs and coaches, they're on that call. They had a rehearsal earlier this week and they hashed through a few problems like, what do we think? People that can't figure out how to do the dial-in and guys not putting the mute button on. So they got those issues sorted out. Those should be fine for today, for tonight. And then finally, the league is stressing technology and information security. They do not want picks being leaked out. They want to make sure that the good Goodell, Commissioner Goodell can actually do the picks first. So they've instructed their media partners, look, don't leak any picks. Don't let your reporters tip people off on Twitter. We need the teams to make their picks on the conference call and then give them to Commissioner Goodell so that he can be the one making the picks. A big reason for that security, a lot of gamblers are gambling on who's going to go in which position. So maybe you and your son can have fun figuring out what the top five players draft will be. Make some money oh, he, betting he's on that. Got his, Kelly, back Eric, to you. he's got his own Eric, he's got his own draft board all set up with his friends, who includes Scott Wapner's uh, uh, young son. There is a, a rabid competition here as to who's going to come out on top. I would just advise everybody, what you said was very true. The mute button is your friend, man. The mute button is critical.